Is everything okay with you and Draymond Green that he, he called you called you out, called you Nikki? Give give us a summary of why Draymond Green has a problem with you. Well, because Draymond Green's true passion is media criticism, not basketball discussion. And Draymond, like, let's let's be very clear here on what's happening with Draymond Green. Draymond Green finds does not see the obvious hypocrisy in his opinion that if you didn't play in the NBA, you shouldn't have a seat at the table at discussing or criticizing or critiquing NBA players. However, if you have no training whatsoever in journalism, commentary, or media, you, of course, are able to criticize professionally trained journalists, commentators, and media. And by the way, I, I think athletes turned commentators is a great thing. I am not trying to exclude anyone from the group. I, I think there's an obvious hypocrisy in those trying to exclude others, not wanting that same exclusion to happen to them. But the other thing is this, like Draymond is, he's running out of content. And so, Liz, we talked about my Andrew Wiggins thing. He had a lot of my Andrew Wiggins stuff wrong, They're saying that I need to, you know, own up to the opinion. I tweeted out the Andrew Wiggins take the moment the Warriors beat the Mavs. I'm the one that put it back into the ether, but that's fine. But that got that got him some traction. People were like, oh, yeah, kill Nick on Andrew Wiggins. So he does it right after they win the championship, and then he goes on a little 10-day break and the next podcast, and it's like, oh, boy. This time of year, the sports commentary game's a little tough. So no, no games going on, no sports, no stories. So let's just run it back. Uh, but then Skip was on vacation, Stephen A's on vacation, and all of a sudden it's like, oh boy, <laughs> you know what? What if I run that same Nick, almost word for word, the same Nick Wright opinion, but I'll call him Nicholas. Woohoo! <laughs> oh, that'll get him. That'll get him. And so, listen, I get it, uh, new media. And so, you know, I mean, they're coming for all of us. But I just, you know, I'm excited to see what the next chapter is.